Gorilla Tag Ghost, very well known for hacking, banning, and kicking other players. And one of Gorilla Tag's biggest debates is whether or not Gorilla Tag Ghosts are actually real or if they're fake. And that's why today I'm going to be answering the question, are Gorilla Tag Ghosts real? On February 12th, 2021, a game called Gorilla Tag was released. And not too long after the official launch of Gorilla Tag, we got introduced to a new ghost. And his name was PBBV. PBBV became the face of Gorilla Tag. And this bot was trending, getting content creators millions and millions of views. But obviously, this trend's just gonna die out like any other trend, right? Well, the clear answer to that is no. In fact, Gorilla Tag Ghost just got more popular. And a ton of new ghosts were coming to the game like Daisy09, Echo, and J3VU. And obviously, the list goes on and on, but I think you get the point. Now, I'm gonna hop into a public lobby to see what the community thinks about Gorilla Tag Ghosts. Do you believe in Gorilla Tag Ghosts? Do you believe in Gorilla Tag Ghosts? No. Do you believe in Gorilla Tag Ghosts? Do you believe in Gorilla Tag Ghosts? No, because they're either modders or they're just little kids trying to pretend to be them. And this leads me right into the next point, the Gorilla Tag Trollers, which basically consists of somebody using a soundboard while impersonating a ghost. And this topic blew up. And the more Gorilla Tag trolling videos there were, the less the community believed in ghosts. And while I was interviewing people, I got lucky enough to actually find a Gorilla Tag ghost. Now at first, he seemed pretty legit. But then I started seeing some unusual movements that you wouldn't see in an actual ghost. Which led me to believe that this was just a troller. And while the Gorilla Tag trollers were starting to become very big, so were the Gorilla Tag hackers. Gorilla Tag hackers are commonly mixed up with Gorilla Tag ghosts. And a prime example of a Gorilla Tag hacker is the Bees era. This Gorilla Tag hacker would spam Gorilla rigs to make everybody in the lobby lag. But there's definitely a huge difference between Gorilla Tag hackers and Gorilla Tag ghosts. But back to the question, are Gorilla Tag ghosts real? I'm going to be hopping into some haunted codes to actually see if I could find a real ghost. Okay, I'm looking for Gorilla Tag Ghosts. Are there any Gorilla Tag Ghosts? In no, not at all. All right, well, the first code was not haunted at all. But this is where I ran into a pretty big problem. Every code that I would try to join was full. I'm going to spam this button until I get in. But after enough times clicking the enter button, I finally got into a code. And this is what I found in the code. He's very rare. Hey. What the? Yo, what is this? It's Gorilla Tag Ghosts? I saw that, I saw that, I swear. Guys, everybody come to Forest, look at this guy. He was just in the ground. It could be very hard to tell the difference between a Gorilla Tag Ghost and a Gorilla Tag Modder. But this Gorilla Tag Ghost was unfortunately fake. I can only tell because there are a ton of mod menus that do the same exact thing that Ghost was doing. But finally, for the point of the video. Are Gorilla Tag Ghosts real? And for a long answer short, the answer is no. If you have ever seen a Gorilla Tag Ghost before, all odds are, it's just fake. Even TTT Pig, who is an official moderator for Gorilla Tag, said that ghosts are not real. That ghosts aren't a real thing, like PBBV and any other ghosts like that, like Daisy 9 or whatever. Those are all just, um, people with mods. So the next time you encounter one of these Gorilla Tag Ghosts, you can one, report them, or number two, mess with them, because who doesn't like a little bit of trolling a troller? But I hope that answers your questions, and goodbye.